Got him. Well, I'm going to continue eating while someone else recaps. Someone recap. While I frantically fix things. All right, cool. Things frantically fixed. We fought the stuff. And we defeated the um, unicorn-eating motherfucker. And um, then, yes, and the stuff they summoned, I guess, incidentally. Um, and then Ben and Elsa showed up. Also, Elsa, you've grown up. That's not good. Um, and then Sarah strength the goop and we stopped playing. I think that's basically what happened. I can't mm. remember anything else. Yeah. Shit ton of campfire. A lot of campfire. While having a, yeah, we're having a bro training session and talking about virtues. Mm, just bros being bros, yeah. Yep. Bros what being like, bro, what the fuck is this? Bro. <laughs> bro. <laughs> Give me drugs, and they did. Okay. Okie dokie, okie dokie, okie dokie. So, um, did Blue and finish, did Blue and Saris finish their yes, talk? Yes, I think so. Yeah. Okay. Um, Prim, you've already, you've already finished yours. I mean, I, let's, let's say finish. <laughs> not much, not much to it. Um, uh, what would happen first? It's not the worst thing to roll for that. All right, I want. I, oh boy. I, I want everybody to roll me a d one hundred. Sixty six. Two eighties. All right. Oh my God, eighty was rolled by the black goop. I'm the black goop now. Roll d twenties, d twenties, Prim and Saris. No, the people who had the black goop rolled eighties. Oh, okay. Two. All right, we'll go in that order. All right, so. Starting from the, starting from the bottom, oh, Alicia. Yes. No. <laughs> Alicia. Yes. Hi. Like hell, she's a bottom. I mean, she's a power bottom. <laughs> That's a thing. Nah, she's probably she's probably a fucking switch. Anyways, um. I'm sorry. Are we talking about Blue? No, go ahead. Go ahead. No one said Blue's name. <laughs> okay. Yes, Blue probably is. <laughs> <laughs> I did not hear it. Go ahead. I was like, cool, I don't want to have this conversation. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I made the joke. Let's go. Blue. Yes. You get a soft knock in the morning. The morning. Okay. At your door. Story immediately vanishes because because there's people now, and you know how story is with people. He's not. She's not. It's not. They are. I uh, haven't figured that out yet. Blue's gonna kind of look over to where story was, and kind of blows some hair out of her eyes, and she's like, you don't have to be so shy all the time. Not like me, just saying it, and then she'll 
yell, uh, still laying in her bed. Uh, doors open. And uh, in comes Ben. And uh, he looks around and then looks directly at the story and says, Ah, right room. You are invited to breakfast. Me or the dragon? <laughs> Shit, you were the. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Hello. Good morning. Morning. You're invited to breakfast. I'm sorry, I'm looking for everybody. Uh, okay. I don't know where, but could you go find people for me, please? This is very hard. It's very bright in here. Yeah, sure, I'll get everyone. And he walks off. All right, uh, we will get dressed, get ready, and she'll go find everyone's rooms. All right, so first person's first. Uh, next on the list, I believe, is Leo, unless I'm mistaken. Oh, shush. I'm sorry. Alex. What? what? You're next. What? What? <laughs> I, uh, one sec. One sec, guys. I, I I know I'm next. I just don't know what what that has to do with anything. <laughs> no one's mentioned no. anything about me. Is it that yeah, I'm going yes. to Leo next? Okay. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, no, no. I'm sorry. Someone was talking to me. I apologize. The the, the dog started barking and no, we were just complaining. We were just. Alex was confused about whether he'd been mentioned. So, Leo. <clears throat> yes. Uh, you're tired from your last night's exertion, but not exhausted. Just you know, little achy. Sore. And, yep. and uh, uh, you get up and start, you know, doing your morning routine. When a soft knock comes at your door, it would be blue. Blue, do your thing. Is a soft knock. Uh, you hear a knock on your door. Are you decent? I don't care too much, but I figure I should ask. Yeah, I'm good. She's gonna open. Hey, breakfast somewhere. I don't know. <laughs> I actually probably should have asked where breakfast was. I'm guessing there's some place to get food. Okay. Um. Excellent. Thank you. He's just kind of confused. Packing up his stuff. Yep. Chill leaf. And the next door you head to is Evan. Right. Evan, you're already up. Yep. Bright and early. Yep. Stretching. You, you're, you're doing your stretches. Um kinda got you kinda got a little pain in your in your wrist from you may you may have like pulled the muscle. Mm-hmm. But still got a weird nothing. soreness from the uh the the infernal wounds. The, the, nothing, nothing too, too bad. Nothing no. I can't deal with later. Mm-hmm. Uh, and uh, <clears throat> and uh, you almost sense the knock before it actually happens. <laughs> yep. Uh, blue, do your thing. Uh, essentially the same thing. Uh. Are you decent? Don't care. Really don't care if you're not. Uh, I think I should ask. You're learning. I'm decent. 
listen, you were in the bath last time. You were, or you were supposed to be in the bath. I wouldn't have seen anything if you were in the bath. No, you didn't. But know. you had to be doing push-ups outside, which was weird. I will admit, like, I do want to address this. You were doing push-ups outside the bath. And yet you went into someone's bathroom and didn't knock. I'm still getting used to knocking. It's hard to knock on a circus tent. Things that I didn't know about Blue before. Okay, uh, breakfast then? Yep. Okay. <clears throat> All right, I walk out. I'm clothed. Aw. <laughs> <laughs> um, and we move on to. I think. I think it's Saris. Saris rolled the two, right? I did. Yeah, Saris. You feel good. You feel better than good. You feel great. Did I sleep? You... Did you want to? I pro was I tired enough to sleep? I was under the impression yes. I was exhausted. Yes. In which case, yes. Okay. Yes, you did. All right. And uh, they were pleasant dreams. Not okay. It's a little sad because it was like it because it was of family. Hey, look how these and... people I built yesterday. And uh, uh, it was the family all together. That's never happened before. No, it has not. Except since the funeral. Even then, people kind of came. Even then, it kind of was. <coughs> I'm aware. <laughs> and uh, you hear a knock at your door. Yes. Uh, Saris, my love, my darling, have you awakened, or do you need a kiss to do so? I am awake. Oh. Hey, uh, apparently everyone's meeting downstairs for breakfast. Thank you. Yep, are you feeling okay? Do you need anything? No, I'm fine. You good? Yeah. Is that, like, actually good, or Sarah's good? I'm not sure what that means. But you say you're good, but then you're not, and you're mad at me. Why would I be mad at you? <laughs> I imagine Blue doing the longest... One eyebrow raise possible. Just she's waiting. <laughs> what? There's. Do you have a response? Oh, I'm genuinely confused. She she asked, "Is it, you know, is it you're actually good, or is it where you say you're good and you're actually mad at me?" I'm not mad at you. Okay, I'm just checking. You sure? Certain. Okay. See you down for breakfast? You know it. Save a seat for me. And she'll go off to the next person. All right. I need you to roll an intelligence intelligence check, please. Ah, yes. I'm good at that. Let's let's tr let's do that. Yeah. Okay. Oh fuck. So two things two things happen. You're walking down down the uh down the way. And you're 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 thinking to yourself, I wonder how Prim's doing. Didn't really see her all that much last night. Then you think about it. Didn't see her go into a room last night. Loading bar slowly fills up. <laughs> <laughs> She's probably oh. in a puddle of goo on the floor. It's fine. Oh, fuck. Hmm. And I don't know how to find her. There is one good way. Locate Prim. 
very specific. Uh, no. Screaming, yes. Prim! Prim! <laughs> You're in a magnificent mansion. Scream really loud. <laughs> I do it harder. Blue. With, 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 with. Uh, hang, Serve hang, on, it. I, hang on, I got this. <clears throat> Blue, stop screaming. You're not prim. No, I mean, not that I'm you're complaining. And there are servants here. I haven't seen any. Excuse me, servant. <laughs> A servant appears. Thank you. Can you uh, help us find Prim? Right this way. Thank you. Evan just does the shrug like, really? You didn't try that? <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. I just spend all of my time in mansions everywhere. Yeah, I'm surprised you didn't have one give you a bath like I did. Wait, what? <laughs> First yeah, off, just, you, that's you rude you didn't ask me. Second, <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> no response. He just keeps following the servant. Was it before or after you did push-ups outside the bath? No response. <laughs> did you make them watch that? <laughs> <laughs> and is anybody else coming to go see to go see Prim? Sure. Yeah, I, think, I think I think that's a reasonable thing for me to do. Leo doesn't know where he's going, so I feel like he's just been following Blue this whole time. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> like. I wasn't ah, breakfast. Blue, but then I was screaming, so it made sense about, that you guys yeah. came. Then she started screaming for some reason. So, uh, so I need you all to roll a perception check. I'm really good at this. Except for prep. Except for prep. <clears throat> okay, I don't have disadvantage, so that's just a twenty. So you all suck, except for Leo. I always roll low. On <laughs> I rolled bad this time. What do you want? So you all suck except for Leo. And uh, Leo, you yes. almost you 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 watch this servant like doing its chores and business and everything, and you notice something strange. Some uh, the servants seem to be moving. Uh, or seem to be moving away from a, away from a certain direction in the same direction that you're going, as well as all of the servants look like the same person. A man, tall, not regal, just tall. Some tall scrub. And. So short. Uh, Yes, so very short, extremely short. He's like a foot tall. And uh <laughs> and uh they all have a sour face no matter how pleasant the the the, the servants I get I get a sensation notation. of wanting to punch it because it has undeserved confidence. It What'd you pass by does? the mirror? <laughs> <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> yep, that's very you good literally show. killed him. I'm I'm very proud of that. That's He's, great. His, uh, do you need do you need a new character sheet? <laughs> <laughs> no, that was good. That was really good. Um and uh uh yeah and eventually you guys come to two doors mm -hmm. one right across the hall from the other a small brown door just like the rooms that you had and a very large set of black doors hmm. i feel like we should be worried the servant points off towards the brown door this is All her right. room. We will go knock on it. Prim! It don't feel so good. 
You don't feel so good at all. How does Lucy open the door? Okay. You all see a very small imp open the door. Prim? Prim, are you okay? Uh, Blue's gonna walk over looking pretty concerned. Prim? Did you take the goo? <sighs> you should have asked one of us. I would have come with you. Huh? Uh, hmm. can I try casting Lesser Restoration to make her feel better? You may try. Okay. Roll a Charisma check for me. Okay. Perfect. 10 out of 10. Would heal again. <laughs> Prem, you feel much better, but... That doesn't change, it doesn't change the other things that happened. It's just you're not sick to the stomach anymore. Did that work? Did you find what you were looking for? Nice. It's good that you're all right. Well, um, we were invited to breakfast. If you're feeling good, you can, do you want to come? And then maybe if we get some time, you can talk later if you need it. I'm sure the man who keeps making himself appear everywhere will have done it. I I don't think servants usually throw people's shit out for no reason. We should get going. Are you okay? Do you need help standing up? Oh, you said last time prestigitation doesn't get rid of that, right? It does not. What was that? It does oh. not. Do you need any help with that? It makes it shiny. Okay. Then we will leave. <laughs> and I walk out. I mean, I don't know what else to do. <laughs> no, it's right. As you guys walk out, you guys hear an explosion happen from within the black st the, the black steel door. Uh, Is that the kitchen? Rock, paper, scissors no. for who opens it. Leo's already I'm trying running. to open it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, good, thanks. You, you throw open wide the doors and a billowing black smoke exits. <laughs> there is a small halfling woman on the floor, face down, Wait. covered in um, soot. 
Are oh, you okay? She's dead? She does not respond. Oh god, she's dead. Uh, hang on, hang on. <laughs> oh god, she's <laughs> dead. Uh, I'm just gonna kind of spare the dying first. <laughs> just in case. She's stabilized. To determine how, how fucked up she is. Just, you Three. know... Well, n now that I now know, that I know she's off death's door, I'll, I want to just see how bad she is. You turn her over. She has burns all over her. <laughs> uh, I'm going to cast Cure Wounds. Cure Wounds, first you, level. You, you oh, cast it. Oh, no, she, she's dead Take now. She, <laughs> she died. <laughs> she fucking died. God damn it. Ah, my plan. Okay, so five, five healing points. Okay, so she like, she like sucks in a sharp bit of air, but it's like black smoke, yep. and she be immediately begins coughing and hacking up a wound. I mean, not a wound, a lung. Both are bad. And are you okay? uh, she goes. <coughs> Breakfast is ready. Does it look like there's breakfast in here? No, there does not. <laughs> uh, Are we supposed to eat smoke? I want everybody to rope me another perception. Really? Can I not roll like shit today? I mean... You should be. You should of get all the things to roll shit on, this yeah. is the worst. <laughs> looking for food. So, Snarris and Leo, you guys see various vials on the Leo. I said Leo. You see various. You see various vials on a table near nearby. Uh, rows upon rows of them, all different colors. Uh, in the back, you see a cauldron that has. That has the top of it blown away, and uh, metal shards everywhere. I was that supposed to be breakfast? Prim and Prim, you recognize said metal shards, like immediately upon entering the room. <coughs> nope, <coughs> it was. Breakfast this time, and I did it. I made breakfast, and she holds up five vials. So they are all different colors between red, green, blue, yellow, and uh, white. Of takes the blue various one. of various liquids. Blue takes the blue one. She doesn't drink it, but she takes the blue one. Um, what kind of uh, breakfast is this exactly? It's liquid five breakfast. Evan starts to twitch his left eye. Do you mean baby food? No, liquidified breakfast. <laughs> twitch, twitch, twitch. <laughs> I, I don't mean to be weird, but I'm a very big man. Can't hear Can't you, Alex. Uh, Leo's like, I don't mean to be weird, but I am uh, significantly larger than the rest of them. I need more than this, probably. No, it's fine. An application of good berry combined with various alchemical processes grants you one good solid eat for the day liquefied breakfast. Uh, I was just hoping for scrambled eggs. This, <laughs> this does not a satisfying answer to Leo, but he doesn't say anything. <laughs> and what advantages do these bring over good berry? I don't know. 
Considering it appears to have almost killed you. Oh, they always almost kill me. Uh, last time I saw him, he, he came into my room and left. Do the Possibly? colors mean anything? Wix! Wix! The blue one's for me. And you see one of the well, servants. Obviously. You see one of the f servants walk inside uh, and walk up to Elsana, who's slowly trying to get to her feet. Could you go find oh, Ben and bring him to bring him to the lab, please? And the servant nods and heads out the door. And uh, she looks up at you, all of you. So, I do believe you all have two things to do today. You're visiting the witches with Ben? We already visited the witches. We're going back. Probably more hair. And you guys need to take one of these each. Well, three of you do. And she pulls out black vials. <sighs> so, anyone want to go first? I will. Um, should I... Um cast any protective spells, or would it interfere? Yeah. Well, well... Oh, I can help with that. I did all your... I, I inspected your flowers last night. The servants came to me about, well, all of them. Yeah, I touched your, all their shit last night. You kind of left them in the kitchen. I didn't know what to do with them, so I had to... And she steps out and starts walking down the hall. Does she answer the question of whether a protective spell would be... Uh, disruptive. Um, so you will look back and just kind of shrug. It's up to you. If you think you should do it on your own or with friends, that's it's a that's a you problem. It's not one I can decide for you. Alia. And she will keep walking. As she's walking away, Evan will look over at uh, the breakfast vials. <clears throat> He'll take the green one and give it a shot. All right. You down the vial. No. Mm -hmm. Uh... You down the vial. Yep. And, uh... Unfortunately... You haven't used any, so... It doesn't matter. But you would recover... One spell slot of your choice. I did use one. Mm, you did. Oh, you used Cure Wounds. Yep. So you recover one one spell slot of your choice. Hmm. As you taste the most delicious salad you've ever had in your entire life. <laughs> salad, though. Wow, That's salad. horrible. That's a horrible smoothie. <laughs> <That's>, <sighs> it's made of kale. Breakfast salad. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> mm, like, imagine what kind of dressing that is. You're drinking it. Spinach and kale. But good. 
but tasty? Unpossible. And satisfying? Also you also energizing. feel full. Yeah. I've never known a salad to make me feel full, but this did it. Huh. Yeah, it actually works. Ugh. Her methods are scary, but she did good work. Uh, we took the green one, so red, blue... No, blue's gone. So red, <laughs> yellow, and white. All right. We can so, mix the red in there if you want it. Mm -hmm. That's... Yeah. Look at what just making them did. Imagine if we tried to mix them. I believe she watched. She almost died for a salad. A liquid salad. <laughs> Not that good. <laughs> All right. So you drink it, and it is the, 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 the smoothest and sugariest cream that you've ever had. And, uh... I think we picked the wrong ones, guys. <laughs> and, uh... It's... It's satisfying to the point of being of filling your belly. And let me go see what I said for this one. Right. You have advantage on perception checks involving smell. There you go. For 24 hours. Forever. Forever. <laughs> yes. And now you can smell everything. Is that a good or bad thing? Probably both. All right, Sarah, which one do you want? Go. There's a golden one, right? There's a yellow one. That'll do it. Close enough. The yellow one. All right. So, you know Amon's cookies, right? I probably do. The most delicious cookies you've ever had. This yeah, cookie... Mom is fucking Kaelin, that's a different thing. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Go ahead. Are we going to talk about your dragon fetish now? Is that what we're doing? No. Okay. Go ahead. You sure? We can yeah. talk about it. No, I don't know what you're talking about. Go ahead. This this vial of liquid puts those those cookies to shame. It is the best lemon cookie you've ever had, ever. That's the problem. Amon would never make lemon cookies. Yeah, because lemons are the devil. <laughs> as as Jalen as Jalen would agree. say as Jalen would demand Amon to make those lemon cookies. Jalen would probably eat lemons, honestly. So. And your well, belly is full. And you have the oddest feeling that things are going to go your way today. You're not oh, sure man. what that means. Okay. That, that's exciting. Yeah, but we don't know what they do yet, so. Uh, if everyone else is blue, we'll drink the blue one. All right. Yeah, uh, I'll have my red at some point. You turn it into a blueberry. All right. Who wants to drink? Who wants to drink it first? Uh, Alex, you can. 
Okay, I will drink mine first because do, do you, you can't want... drink at the same time, guys. It's blood! <laughs> no, I'm joking. Do, do, do. Awesome! <laughs> <laughs> oh no, Fuck the it. werewolf got blood. <laughs> so metal. It is liquid ham. <laughs> Ew! That's the worst thing I've ever heard. <laughs> but it's uh. the most... It's, but it's okay. the most delicious honey ham you've ever had. Listen, I think we all learned that Jamie's taste is shit. I think that's the real <laughs> takeaway from all this. Lemon cookies are fine. <laughs> Lemon sweets are pretty good. I, I gotta say, I think this is probably the one that Leah would like the most, but also still, what the fuck? <laughs> it, it would probably be Terrace's favorite. Thing, honey, honey ham is delicious. Yeah, but it's not supposed to be liquid. And you have advantage on constitution saves for the day. Definitely needed that. <laughs> advantage on con saves. All right. <sighs> Your belly's full. Okay, Feels yeah. like you just ate nothing but ham for the last hour. That's Why would I do feeling? this? So do I... Alright, blue drinks the we know, blue. We know Cupcake. Oh, cupcake, cupcake agrees, apparently. Cupcake heard ham. Give us ham. Oh no. That should be the you title. Know, <laughs> you know. <laughs> Unless something better comes up, yeah. I doubt this. Honestly, I doubt there's going to be something better at this point. Alright, and uh... There's blue and her blue. Uh, oh, jeez. Did you did you have the blue vial and that's what we have to listen to? Hold on. He might. Hey, uh, Evan, what's your height? Uh, give me a second. I actually I have that written down. Oh, six. What was it? It six. is six. Six. Six feet. Hero height. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh. Are you... Are you... Okay. Uh, no, there is only one giant. And then the giant boy. It's the rest of us. The rest of us are pretty average size, actually. I know. It's small. Um, so... Alex, what are the keys for a screenshot? I can't remember. On the Mac. On the Mac. Pray to Satan and sacrifice a goose. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, go ahead, Chris. So blueberry, blueberry. That's it's what not it tastes actually like. Blueberry. It's not a blueberry. So you drink it, and blue. Mm -hmm. You're not. You've never actually tasted this before. Like it has nothing to like compare to it. But if you were to put words into it, it would be like tasting the night sky. The fuck? Okay. It's fine. And, Ooh. uh... Okay. You feel yourself slowly, slowly drift off the ground. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes! No, She's gonna get that right fly. now. No, I'm sorry. I'm pretty sure she can fly, actually, but. I'm floating. Mm hmm. <laughs> that blueberry. She's going to look down and she's like, well, that's new. You feel, you feel strangely full. But you're not sure full of what. 
Hot yeah. Ye- great. Thanks yeah, for that it, one. It's it's probably <laughs> helium. I was gonna say hot air, but you know, it's okay. I did say hot air. God damn it! We're just gonna have a fun. How high off the ground is she floating? Only like two inches right now. Okay. She's gonna just float around everybody. This is great. She loves this. <laughs> That's a. Oh, I should have asked that shit. Can I? <laughs> Too late. You can't ask. Well. You fall back to Earth immediately. No, I'm joking. Uh, yes, you can. Yes. You now are under the effects of the fly spell for the next 12 hours. Oh my gosh. So wait, can I go higher? Mm-hmm. Yes! As high as low Earth, fly spell. Blue's doing like flips and shit in the air. This is great. She can't get that high off, but she's still doing it. And yeah, you all continue to follow uh, Elsana, who looks very injured. Okay. And uh, you all make it to the kitchen where Primrose, your flowers have all been neatly organized and and put together and lined up and have little note cards underneath each one and uh with your book to the side also very neatly set it was as if somebody with ocd came in saw your mess and was just like no this can't stand Oh, that's all gone. They threw that out. So, um, the note cards do, are pretty much defining each flower or seed or and its effects. Um, good news. Most of the ones you have have been defined already, and you already have them. So, bad news, or, or it could be good news, it depends on which, what you want to put. So, the green lily one. It has, it is, it is called Life's Pine. Mm-hmm. L- life, as in L-I-F-E. Apostrophe S. Yes. Pine. A pine that belongs to life. Mm-hmm. It's not mm-hmm. life's spine. That's different. It applies 1D healing and can regenerate a limb over a month if drank once a day. 1D healing? 1D6 healing. Any more is a deadly poison that kills within an hour unless treated by a greater restoration, heal spell, or wish. Nice. Yes. So drink it once a day over a month. But if you drink it more than once a day, you die. The red and wait, which which ones do you have? I'm sorry. Yes. Uh, didn't you get another black one? Didn't you get another black one? Okay, okay, okay. So. The red and purple one, you kind of already know. Which is the 2d8 poison damage, and for the next three hours, your spell save DC is increased by one. 
It is called the Phoenix Nightshade. Do you remember when um it's called Phoenix? Do you remember when you grabbed it and it would it kept you reappearing. it kept reappearing? And uh I think that's it if you only have those two. Everything else you have you have when it came when it comes to the other ones. Yes. Mm hmm Any more is a deadly poison that kills within an hour. Unless treated by greater restoration, the heal spell or wish. You can imagine what kind of assassination attempts you could use with this. Oh, to 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 just remind you, the the life's pine is green lily like flowers with white tipped petals. Shaped flowers. Did you get, uh, do you know the purple, the red and purple star flower? Purple star flower with the red stripe through each petal. Purple star flower. stripe through the center of each petal. All right. So eventually Elsana will look to you all of you and say, "I need to go fetch Ben." But and she sets the 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 black vials on the counter. That's low enough for her and low enough, for, there's like two counters, essentially. One's low for normal people, and one's low for halfling people. <laughs> and she puts it on the halfling counter and says, I'll be with you shortly. I need to give him his medication. Are we supposed to take these before we leave? It is up to you. find it likely that it'll be debilitating for the day. I'm kind of confused. I feel like we keep bouncing back and forth between we have to take these, and we're supposed to take these, and we can choose to take these. Well, you have to take them to find your virtue. You're supposed to take them because you want to fight that demon hatred, right? And it is always your choice. All right. That's a semantic choice.
think that if we're all together, we should be able to handle it. Spells and all such things. Hi, Cat. Cat. That's what I was speaking of. I mean, the lesser restoration seemed to help you a bit. You know, when you were done. This is what I'm talking about. Oh, do you mean the seats help while you're in the black goo? Was that bad for you? Well, then, I guess the final question is, are we going to do it this morning, or are we going to wait till after we go see the witches again? How long will it take you to grow those seeds? Don't think uh, we have that time. How many... How many do you have? Then I think by all means we should use it. But yes, that's what I'd like to know. Are we doing it this morning or are we waiting until after we see the witches? I suppose it's your choice, isn't it? It's your choice. You're the leader. Oh, I don't think we can do much else during the day we do it. Uh, Blue Show, she's like, I could take it and just lesser restoration myself. And besides, if I'm out of the picture I don't for think a day, it work. shouldn't be too bad. Eh. If I'm out of the picture for a day, I don't think you guys will be too, you know, worse for wear. I just stand in the back and give you guys thumbs up and hit on you. Perhaps we should check with, well, Ben and Alsana, how uh, urgent their need for the witches is. I think I still don't fully understand why Ben can't go to the witches by himself. Well, that's more than fine. You're not taking it today. <clears throat> a day away, I believe we're not not far at all. We'll probably do it and then take them. If I'm not mistaken. <clears throat> throughout throughout this whole thing, Evan's just been like like doing the side back and forth, like trying to think. Um, I just want to clarify something. I think we may be Prim. I'll I'll clarify two things. Prim. Uh you use magic when you make your tea. It it consumes one to make the tea. But you can give it to all sorts of all the people at the same time. Yes. From one seed. Oh, I, I was wondering if you didn't understand whether or not um, we had enough seeds. If you if they, if you were going to use four seeds or if you were going to use one seed. Okay, okay. Yeah. Um. And to clarify the whole like Ben going to see the witches thing. Why are you doing? 
you're not you do not have to however he asked you he asked you to come one and two he is more than willing to go alone he's just he just said i'm going back to the witches do you want to come well i think we have something more important to take care of okay I know some people want to go. I'm just saying it's it was not forced upon you to go see the witches. Okay. Yeah, Leo just didn't understand why. Mm-hmm. <laughs> no, I understand. It, you get there's there's it is an optional thing. This is okay. technically what you would call a side quest. Huh. Well, I also don't necessarily see any problem with doing it first and then drinking the goo when we get back for the night and then just sleeping. That's, if people that's... want to do the side quest, as it is called. Yeah, I mean, I'm blues down for I mean, either or. Prim want to go there so that she can do stuff with the witches. And yeah, we should do that. Okay. All right. Let's do side quest and do it up later. Well, no. Yeah. Um, I need to go let the mud out, so I will be right back. Short break. I guess. Short break. Ta -da. Did you guys see the fucking height comparison? Yes. I didn't see it. Get I hate Leo's it. It's fucking tall. <laughs> oh god, Leo. <laughs> Leo's an absolute unit. That, this isn't something we didn't know. I yeah. didn't realize how much, though. Like, no one's even to his shoulder. It's fine. I also He's like didn't that realize for a Blue is taller than Saris. Yeah, but Sarah's just between Vera's height and Caitlin's height. That's why that is. Yeah, I just didn't realize Blue was taller. I didn't realize you were so tiny. She's slightly below average height. So tiny. Sure, tiny. How's the weather? How's the weather like down there? <sighs> Two inches. <laughs> You know, I'll be honest, the entire time I was we were walking we were walking down the hall, I just imagined Blue is just in the lounge pose, like hovering right by Saris. Oh yeah. Constantly. Like, She's like this like, is perfect. Like I don't have horizontal. to use my feet. Yeah, completely <laughs> horizontal though. Just like I feel like Leo has to duck a lot in this mansion. Probably based on it's the a fact halfling that it's a halflings. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Meanwhile, Ev while you guys were talking over there, Evan has been like, eh, do I want to take it? Because I was debating just like saying, fuck it, grabbing one and just taking it. Wow. Yeah. I think, okay. If the potential of, hey, the person I'm supposed to bodyguard is going to go into a dangerous situation without me, if I take it this morning, I think Leo would have slammed it like two minutes into that whole what should we do conversation because well i think not... we're going anywhere altogether or nowhere at all yeah why it's to split the party. also i think we want everyone to have the benefit of or protection uh tea and protection from evil and good yeah or bless for the saving throws. Bless is actually probably better. I can do that. I will I will say Just because this. specifically do it one at a time. Oh yeah. I also have bless by the way, so what do you mean about do it one at a time? Don't all three of us slam it back at once. But that would be the most optimal way to do it because of the spell durations. Okay. 
if someone fails, or if two people fail. Well, that's that's the reason we won't, well, we won't all fail because we'll uh-huh. have all our buffs. Uh huh. Well, I mean, bless is a. Lo- I'm pretty sure we can recast bless. Yes, the the issue is the T. Well, from how I see it, which is fine. I'm just saying, hey. I don't think we'll fail. Okay. I think perhaps it might be wise to at least see someone getting out of the gate before we send the next person through hell. But that's How out of character. How long did it take me to do it? For you? It took like 30 seconds. Oh, for, well I mean, to, I mean, yeah, I mean like... for, for, for everybody else's perspective, it took like 30 seconds for you to go through like the dry okay, heat. Okay, then in which case we could do two per one minute cast we're we're fine it'll be fine it'll be fine and we'll all have why are you trying so hard to conserve resources because that's how you play the game but it'd be nighttime because that's how you play the because we're supposed to that's look you're breaking noah (laughs) I'm not using this fucking X potion. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, for the longest time in Al- the game that Alicia DM'd, there was a player who was a druid and the main healer, and Uh-oh. she wouldn't leave her-, her wild shape form to heal people because she thought she only got one per long rest. And she, Honey. once she turns into a giant ape, she can't come back. <laughs> Honey. Have you read the rule book? No, she is not. <laughs> it's literally right there. Two wild shapes per day. Hey. That's played for goddamn reading. years, says Alicia, but... shouting from getting it or whatever. <laughs> is this um the same one? No. Okay. This is one of the people from our in person group. Yes. And I will give her credit in that the reason she plays D&D is not because she likes D&D. It's because she likes to hang out with her friends. So, like, I can't... I have... I am much more lenient with her than the other girl who doesn't get how the fucking game is played, but also plays every night and DMs a game. She's a DM? Yeah, I cannot process a woman who asked, can I use sneak attack on my cleric? DMing. You can if you're also a rogue. Guessing she wasn't, though. No. Was she at least trickery domain? No. Oh, no. Life. Oh, God, no. Life. Life clerks are notorious. I'm being told to tell you about the heels, but I don't know what that means. Alicia, tell us for a second. Oh, yeah. This woman thought she could only cast a spell once per day. Oh, so like three. Okay, okay. Like third edition, rather. Yikes. Oh, like third ed in Pathfinder. Got it. Yeah. Oof. If I have it prepared, I can only cast it once. Nope. That's my prepared use of it. Yeah, they made everyone like third edition sorcerer. Hello. Hi. Hi. Yeah, she was like, I can't heal you guys because I already cast that spell. Uh, Wizard is the only one that's not uh, like third ed sorcerer. Even then, you can still cast all your spells after you've prepared them once. Yeah, no, no, like, currently Wizard is more like Pathfinder Arcanist. I never played an Arcanist. It's literally Arcanist, because Arcanists were the mix between Sorcerer and Wizard. Where you had, oh, I have these spells in my spellbook, I'm going to pick out a couple of these, and then I've got the slots to cast all of them with. Okay, so this terrible girl. The reason she said that as a life cleric, she could not heal us 
was because she'd already cast Cure Wounds and Healing Word, and that's it. That was it. We're like, hey, do you want to heal anyone or anything? And she, she just kept fighting and stuff. And she's like, well, I already cast my healing spells for the day. And we're like, no, you have a ton of spell slots. And she's like, no, but I've already used Cure Wounds and Healing Word. And we're like, Izzy, what the fuck are you talking about? You've been a healer for fucking like six months. In the other game. What the fuck do you mean that you only can? What? I'm also pissed. I'm also pissed with her right now because her character died, and we're doing a one shot, and her character died. Oh no! So oh. we're trying to introduce her new character in. Yeah. And her new character thought it would be a good idea, knowing full well that she had to integrate herself into our group. That while we were being attacked, to cast sleep on all of us. Not the monster, not the guy who's attacking us, but sleep on us. So we all fell asleep. She ran away. We got robbed. But she left a note on us later after the guy left um, saying sorry. So that made it up. (laughs) Why did she do that? (laughs) Like, why? Yeah. No, but so, she used the But it system. came time for her to join the party. Playing uh this one character who is dumb bitch. As much of a bitch, if not more than Did you say as myself? As herself. Yeah. We were cutting out so we didn't pull so, in. So my girl just literally cause Okay, so the girl came up to us as one of the characters, is, one of the other players is trying to get her into the group. And what is she, oh God, Alex, what did she say? It was like, if the guy hadn't already taken your snails, I would have. That was what we were collecting <laughs> for a ton of money. So she's like, yeah, if the guy hadn't robbed you, I would have robbed you. And then she's like, can I join your group? And my girl's like, fuck no. But you have to because oh god. No, yeah, we I I essentially had my arm twisted until Yeah, that's not she your was fault, allowed to cool. join. But like I was like, fuck no. You know, I don't think she even would have cared if she had been told that. She doesn't give a shit. I don't know why she plays. Yeah, like she just doesn't it's that I think it's the most frustrating thing is that she doesn't care and that she doesn't care that you care. Mm. Like when the one one of the characters died and a good chunk of that was her fault and she laughed and told him she didn't care. That she Yeah, I want to. That's... It's not my game. Oh. But they like the before. other people. But they like the yeah. other people. Oh no, you like them. We do. We just also complain about them. Are you complaining to the DM? Like raising legitimate concerns to the DM like that? Nah, because he's hard for. <sighs> okay, you he might want to leave this game. Oh. Yeah. Damn it. We're trying to help you, and this situation is not great for you guys. Yeah. Yep. Sorry. Hey, let's play this and let's get pissed at other stuff. <laughs> yes, let's play the video games. Okay, you're back the from the dog. Right. I heard crap. <gasps> Are we done? Are we done Sorry. insulting people? Sorry. We're done insulting people in real life. Let's get back to insulting each other in games. That's not what we're doing, but okay. I mean, I mean, I mean, I'm not saying that it wasn't, it, it wasn't legit insults or that it wasn't, it, or they weren't deserved. 
Okay, do you want to stop doing this, or are we going to keep doing it? But what are you guys doing? You guys going back to see Elsa and Ben? Yeah. He's got to do <laughs> Okay, yeah. Are you guys waiting there, or are you, wait are you going back to see them? I question. thought we were waiting to see them. I think yeah, we're I waiting. Think yeah. Okay. Here. Okay. I'm, I'm still waiting here, still looking at the file, still debating in my head. Okay. No problem. Um, after about 30 minutes of waiting, Elsa and Ben come back. Ben kind of using Elsa's shoulder as a as a guide. And uh, he immediately looks at Blue and says, hello there. Uh, hi. And then he, and then he, and then he jumps and he's like, wait, uh, uh, oh, Jesus. I'm, nah, he's I, seeing story. It's always, it's always difficult to see people. Especially in this place. I can imagine it's not. And uh, he says, well, I'm off to go see the witch. Are you guys coming? The witch is... Yes, I believe that's our plan. Oh, we already discussed this. Well then, let's go. Elsa, could you set up this set up here for... Uh, the next ritual and she nods and heads and starts leading him out of the uh uh the mansion with you guys in tow i assume yep oh well i did want to say goodbye but I mean, bye. And then she just starts walking off. And Ben, you all take Ben outside the mansion. Of course, you know, you guys walk out the door and there's just, there's no mansion behind you. As you guys are back out in this bloody field of a mess. You mean a victory. That's not what it was. <laughs> I mean, it was it was a pretty good victory. The unicorn's gone. Not the unicorn, Pegasus? Pegasus. Not unicorn, Pegasus. Um, sorry, they're both white, and therefore brain brain short circuits and says unicorn. Hey, to be fair, it is missing a wing, so basically unicorn. And um Uniwing. It's a Uniwing. A Unisys. A Pega Uni? No. Stop. And uh he says, Well, who wants to lead me back to the witches? Because I don't remember. Or rather, I don't know. <laughs> Oh, right. Uh, let's see. Pulls out the map. Do you remember what you're supposed to do with the map? Check for the wind and then go in a different direction from the wind. I believe it was right. Yes. We. I probably should have wrote it down. All right, roll intelligence checks for your characters. Son of a bitch. Yep, that's about right. Because it, it doesn't work on ability checks. Saves, but not ability checks. But 10 is enough. Um... 
it was right, but it wasn't that you're supposed to turn right. You're supposed to turn the map 90 degrees to the right. We remembered the right, and we remembered the turn. When I thought of that, I was like, I am so, I'm a genius. That must be a rare thought. Yes, I, it is. It is an extremely rare thought. You won't take it away from me. And so you all head off towards the, uh, uh, since the lake is labeled on the map and Evan has been that direction and now understands what's happening. He can easily get you back in the direction. And, uh, I need, so for, for the travel, it's only about two hours, but for the travel, I need more perception checks. Yippee. Son of a bitch. Mm. Can I roll more than a seven? No. No. Um, what what is what count? Does what count? Uh, no, but you're fine. Don't worry about it. The DC is ten to find the find a new flower. Don't worry about it. Um, um, Phoenix Nightshade is very easy to find. Uh, roll me a D2. Actually, a D3. Okay, so you find a bush of Phoenix Nightshades, but they're much smaller, and the plant seems to be, like, at the end of its life. Well, Do you take any? Phoenix. All right, go for it. And uh, and uh, the second thing you find is um, the black rose flower. It looks all, an awful lot like the one in Kay in Kaylin's uh in Kaylin's uh garden but this one seems a lot more natural like the other ones the ones from kaylin's garden were perfect these look a lot more like you know some of them are dying and some of them are not some of them are bloomed all the way some of them are not it's like when you find wild strawberries mm -hmm. uh you can so it's it's a bush not un Un like dissimilar to Phoenix Nightshade, so it's a big bush. Uh, the leaves are black. Of the on the on the bush itself. Uh, you would still take the flower because that's the that's for you. That's the part that matters. Take the entire. Uh, there are probably, roll a d12 for me. There are nine. Okay. Okay. Mark them down. Black Rose Flower from Feywilds. Wild Black Rose. And, yeah. Uh, so, Saris, you're on the lookout, and you hear a soft humming not unfamiliar from the last time that you heard the humming. 
I was going to say blues playing music again. Well, go ahead, Blue. Play your music. It's pretty good. Not your best, obviously, but I mean, you're moving. I'm floating. Yeah, that that's probably what's throwing you off. You don't have a center of balance. It's just you're just floating. It's it's a still a new sensation. Uh, but yeah, Saris, you hear the uh, the very familiar humming. Now remind me what that meant last time, because I don't remember. Asshole pixie. But the presence that was following us, so we can't like see. The last time you remember it. There was an asshole pixie. Called it. I thought that might be it. But okay. All right. Yeah, could be another asshole. There were pl there are plenty of other asshole pixies, especially in the Feywild. All right. I think we continue on. Yeah. See if Ignore. Should... And uh, it doesn't take you long to get to back into, like, that deadened section of forest that was really gloomy. And uh, Ben seems to be looking around for something and then sees it off in the distance. Ah, there's one. And, and uh, you see one of the witches in the distance. Let me go make sure I have the wit the correct witch before I say names. Oh boy. Yes, I do. Oh no. I mean, good job. I'm actually very annoyed at that concept that you remember their voices. <laughs> Elga. It is Elga. The uh hunched over one with the very odd staff. And uh, she seems to be looking up a tree. Elga! Elga! It's Benethro. Elga! And Elga looks over. Ah! Good, good, good. You have come for more today. And uh, Ben kind of, like, leads you on towards her. Yes, ma'am, I have. Well, children, come to the cottage. Children, why are you all back? We were Aw, uh, you didn't miss us? To the you company. have more riddles. Well, I'm you. sure I can come up with something by the end. You see her smile and, you know, it's a big toothy grin of black and disgustingness. Yeah. And, but, uh, it's, it's a genuine smile. And she goes, good, good. Come, come, children, come with me. Olga and Olga are... Getting lunch ready. Perfect. And you all make your way to the hag's cottage. For hag witches, presumably. But up. You you see the cottage in the distance as uh, an hour passes of you traveling behind her. Do you guys ask her any questions or anything like that? I don't have any questions for her. I don't. Grim? I'm what you would call a hag. 
hags and witches have very similar callings. No, child, no. We are more what you would call... Oh, what is it that the, that the children call it nowadays? A coven? I just call it sister. Those damn kids in the covens. He's walking. Would you like to join us, child? We could always use more sisters. Do, do it, become a hag. Make a new character, do it. <laughs> I understand. I understand. It is fine. If you ever need us, though, always feel welcome to come. Especially if you have riddles. Like spittles. Would any of you like a sweater? And, uh, Ben says, nope, still have mine. Thank you, though. How revealing can you make these sweaters? <laughs> oh my god. You don't know. <laughs> I mean, uh, revealing? Yes. I am unsure what you mean. You know, like showing the goods. <sighs> not don't not, don't acknowledge it. Just <laughs> let it happen. That is not my area of expertise. Perhaps Olga will understand oh, these no. words. Oh, and God. she consent continues on. I think we all need virgin killers. Every single one of us. Yeah, all of us do. I think we all need Jesus, okay? <laughs> Why yeah, not both? Clerk would say that, huh? <laughs> I think y'all need yeah. Jesus. <laughs> and y'all motherfuckers need Lathander, okay? <laughs> and uh, as she gets to the front door, she just pushes it open. And uh, the cottage is again, they're huge. They're almost yeah. they're they're not giant sized. They're not giant sized, but they are at least three to four feet taller than Leo. So they're a like as tall woman. as a small giant. Kind of maybe maybe closer to an ogre. are huge, dude. And uh, they, she opens the door and shuffles you all inside. And uh, inside is, well, the forest itself looked like a looked like a dead place to be in. This looked like walking into hell of a dead place. There's various. And there's a table at the center with three chairs, and a, a, a strewn across the walls is all sorts of manners of various witch implements, as well as some implements you're not quite sure what they do, but you know that you want nothing to do with them. Yep. From uh -huh. and and with and implements. so so the 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 weirdest things that you might see is. A head floating in a jar, 
uh, several eyeballs in a jar, uh, flayed skin that you're not sure isn't human. Nice. And just all manner of bad touch, don't touch situations happening. Why and inside you see Olga at at a in a chair in a rocking chair to the side, knitting. And Olga at the cauldron, mixing. And then bringing the bringing a spoon up to her lips. And then she thinks for a minute, and then reaches for the jar of eyes and plops two in, and then goes back to mixing. <laughs> I am pretending Hello. not to be disgusted by everything in this room. Hello, children. Hi. How are you? Hey, Olga. Olga. Mmm. Needs more salt. Needs more salt. And, uh, the witches all look at you so and they can say in unison how can we help you today ben kind of <laughs> leans back and stretches and says just here for some some more hair you know demon ritual you know. they nod and they nod, and Olga, the, the 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 sister at the cauldron, walks over. I believe it is my turn. Well, are you ready to give up that what you that what you have? He nods and sits and waits, and you see Olga reach down to him. And lightly touch him on the on the top of his head, which is much bigger really than. Really hard. It, it, it's really it's it's really it, he, her finger is much bigger than him. And uh, you see this black aura ri uh, kind of rise up out of out of his form, and he slowly begins to sag, and he says. Okay, I think that's enough. No, just a little bit more and okay. done. And he, like, drops to his knees, panting. Okay. Are you okay? <sighs> yep. Always takes a little bit out of me. Oh, jeez. Delicious. Here is your hair. And she grabs a lock of her hair, own hair and just rips it out. And, and hands it over to Ben. And it's much heavier than him. But he's got it. I mean, he's got it pretty much. He's, his, he's, a, he's a big, strong lad. He's a small, strong lad, you mean? Do, do he's you a need big, help? strong lad. And he says, uh, could you help me fold it so I can, you know, put it in a smaller bun? Yeah, grab that side. Yep. And you guys start folding the hair. It's slimy. Great. Yep, that's about right. Then go L'Oreal. Uh -huh. Anything else, children? Do you make the sweaters out of your hair as well? Sometimes. Other times we make it out of this ha the hair of others. Mm -hmm. Would you like one? Sure. Hmm, your size. Oh, God, I do believe we have one in his size. I think you started making them for them. 
And Olga says, yes, yes, I did. And uh, he, she reaches over into a box and uh, pulls out a black sweater. It is about your size. Very close, so Maybe a little tight around the chest, but not too bad. Thank you. And hands it over. I you know. have just gained a hag sweater. Woo, I did it. It is a cloak of protection. Damn. <laughs> okay, I'll put that on at some point. <laughs> Except it doesn't need attunement. Nice. Why are these hag sweaters so overpowered? Yeah, you can wear it, but it ruins your aesthetic. Mm -hmm. Can I fit it, it on very... over my armor? Yes, and the moment you put it over, it, it doesn't matter that the armor is on. You feel itchy. Uh, okay. Nope, not I'll get used to this, oh, I guess. No. <laughs> oh, no, itchy he, sweater. He, he kind of just high smiles. Feeling. Like, thank you. I did this to myself. <laughs> now, be careful with my sweaters. Okay. Of course. That one was made out of my hair. Thank you for being a deer and taking it. Yes. Not many take our sweaters. They seem to not enjoy it. I think they make you look dashing. Have you got a pinch his cheek, too? <laughs> <laughs> uh, th thank you. And here's some cookies. <laughs> also made of hair somehow. So what, <laughs> so what grade are you in? Oh, it's summer. oh yeah, Grandma Candy, frick yeah! It's summer, Grandma. Well, what grade are you in? I'm in between these grades. Okay, Grandma, I'm in college. <laughs> what grade? What grade is college? Yes. It's yep. yes. Yep. Um, so, yeah. But they offer you soup. Uh, ask if you have anything you need. Offer to, for you to stay for the night. Ask to take our sins away. Uh, want, ask, to, ask to give them more riddles. Oh. I think I'll say no to all of those things, I'm afraid. I have a riddle for them. They immediately stop what they're doing and, like, clamor around you, ready. Oh, gosh. Okay. Uh, and, and they look hungrily at you. All right. I belong to all, and for many I am their fault. Time is my love, changes what I am of. Though too many I am a foe, oh, sorry. Though too many I am a foe, I will never shrink, only grow. Is it a mimic? It's always a mimic. No. Hmm. Is it rivalry? No. Mm. War. No. You have bested us again. And they chew on, they all chew on their lips very angry at themselves. You're going to have to write down that write that one down, sister. You write it down. Yeah. 
Ladies, ladies, please. She gave us a valuable riddle. It will take some time for us to solve it, but we will come back to you for it with an answer. Okay. She looks a little worried about the we'll come back to you because she's planning on leaving. <laughs> Hell yes. Just wake up one night at the tree and there's all the three hacks. <laughs> Anyways, anybody ask any questions, comments, concerns? Does my sweater fit my werewolf self? <laughs> Does it fit your persona? <laughs> Leave me alone. Okay. Yes, <laughs> because it's magical. It's, right. it's it fits ev it fits everybody, no matter what. But. Again, it's itchy. Yeah, he's getting used to it. Uh, Prim, was there anything else you wanted to ask him? Training your and Olga steps forward, looking at you closely. Ah, an initiate of the arts. Wonderful, wonderful indeed. How can we help you, child? Would you like more understanding of what you can do? Practice. Practice what? Ah, the element of water. Olga steps forward. I do believe I can be assistance of assistance there. And she does the same thing to you, same thing as well. Now, child, come sit, and I am going to teach you all about the, wa the water, the water element, and what you can do with it. The water element, Andy. I could see her being Katara. Are you done? Are you done, Cupcake? Are you done? Okay. No, she wanted to go see. She wanted to go see my brother because he was walking around. Um, and yeah, uh, I will say that you have unlocked the next part as she goes through the element. And how ice, how you can form ice. Yes, ice knife. Yippee! Woot. Yahoo! Uh, yeah, so that's it. So are we just gonna head back? That's I what Ben's so. heading planning on doing. Yep, I guess so. Okay. Yeah. Well, I thank them for our hospitality. Mm -hmm. Of course, of course. Ah, by the way, there is one thing to be wary of. I have seen the fairy flim flam about. And be sure not to listen to her games. Wasn't she the one that got squashed? Yeah. Flim, and flam, 
is immortal. Oh, damn well, it. in the case that she crosses our path again, we'll take care of her. I doubt it. As many times as it takes. I doubt it. I mean, could we just put her in a jar? <laughs> we have tried said thing. We have tried cooking her, eating her. I, I mean, just leaving her in the jar. <laughs> she cannot be held by any, any one force, apparently. We are not sure why. We cannot see them. We, we cannot see Flim Flam when we attempt our magics. It is if she is not real. Then maybe she's not. Longer than we have. Ancient evil pixie. That, I think that's what we were doing on the way over. Well, she didn't engage with us, she just sang at us. <laughs> I mean, her voice wasn't bad. The rest of her is, though, so we should consider her. Yeah, no. Yeah, I agree. Thank you for your warning. And you guys leave and are Damn on it. the way back. Damn it, Chris, this is so weird having hags who are actually interested in us succeeding. Usually they're just monsters. Yeah. Uh, as they're heading back, Blue's going to try to float by Prim. Uh, just ask her, are you doing okay? I just meant, you know, you drank the goo stuff on your own, and I just wanted to make sure that you were okay, because that seemed to kind of mess up Saris a bit. Oh, Prim. I forgot to, I forgot to ask. Would you have told her how you uh, how you came about having the water and ice abilities? Okay, I need you to roll a persuasion check for me. Yes, yes. Oh, I'm okay. not flying anymore? Never mind, then. Don't worry about it. I mean... Oh, okay. Oh, I see. I see. Never mind. Don't worry about it. Fuck you. Just says, well... Yeah, good. That that's a good way to think of it. Indeed. Ben will look over. Ben will uh, will look over and say, "At least you hope it won't." He shrugs. And continues onward, returning to the place that you were at. Where uh Elsana 
has made a very, 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 very large ritual circle. Is it made of blood this time? No, it is not. It is Good. dug into the ground. Because otherwise... Uh-huh. Yeah. I caught the Pegasus. <laughs> and uh, and uh, there are various ingredients at each point in <laughs> in this pentagramic circle. Uh, anybody may roll an arcana to see what is happening. <laughs> nope. Alright, well. She can get all right, gonna roll. You can do that. <laughs> Is my thing rolling? Am I? Oh, you mother. Is this thing on? Rip. You guys hear me? Me? Yep. Yeah, it's one of those weird... It's one of those weird things where, like, my Wi-Fi's like, I'm gonna say you're not working. Not work on anything else. But you'll still work on Discord. It's fine. It's just weird. I don't get it. Anyway, blue doesn't know. It's fucking blue. I don't know why I was bothering to roll. That's why Evan didn't roll. All right, so Prim, you see this, and you and you re recall Pantera looking over things, reading various books. This is a dark ritual. Hmm. We summon a demon, and I kill it. Well, I haven't mastered my virtue or sin. So I use it for training. Did you drink the black goo? Yes, I did. Unfortunately, someone like me, it doesn't work. Someone like you? Yes. What do you mean by that? I'm too old for this. The goo Magic. has an age limit? <laughs> God damn it. Actually, it's more like a creature limit. I'm what you would call I guess the closest, closest approximation is demigod. And Osana will say, no, you are not a demigod. Well, then what would you call it? A creature locked in immortality, immortality and eternal life because of time-related magic and manipulations. So, a demigod. Demigod's definitely got a better ring to it. See, she she likes it. Yeah, but a demigod would have a different set of powers. Is that something you wanted? No, it's something that came with this. And he holds out, he he holds out his hand, and a trident appears. It's cursed. <laughs> It's a weapon. The weapon. I just call it the all weapon. 
Does it have a better name? I don't know, nor did I care. But it allows me access to different weapons that have been a part of history. Yes, I noticed. Such as... And, Jake, Evan, do you feel your Thunderbow, the weight on your back, just suddenly disappear? I can see where it's going. It, it, it you, you, you see it reappear where the trident was. Mm hmm. You gonna give that back to me? Of course. Huh. And he hands it back. Okay. Any. I try not to. Well, I can summon any that I know of. And I've lived a very, very long life. Click, click. Wait for it. Wait for it. Okay. Um, and uh, Elsan walks over and says, It's finished. And then looks back at all of you. Well, are you all going to um, continue your training? He shakes his head. This is my task. It's the only way I can get stronger. Would you welcome help? I would. I would not like the help. But if you would like, if you want to help to get training in, you may do so. All right. I will mention that this will be particularly brutal. You see this spell. It's going to be deadly. Indeed, this is your quarrel. Yes, Elsana will take care of... Well, she'll take care of you. How many, how many hours should I set it for this time? Three. Okay. <coughs> be dismissed in three hours. Survive. He nods. And steps to the center of the 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 pentagram. So, you all coming? Yes. And uh she goes back to the door with the mansion and opens it up. As the pentagram begins to light up and a black wall uh, about five feet high surrounds the entire circle. And uh, I want everybody to roll an arcana or history or religion. I'm, I'm so okay good at all of those. I've got one that I can maybe do. Oh, my first good roll of the night. Oot. All right, Evan. Yep. You see a creature rise up out of the... Uh... The, the circle, the, 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 the circle at the bottom, or at from the floor, and uh, you see Ben 
take a few steps back. And then another one pops out. And another. And it's three pit lords. Uh, are you sure he can handle this one? He he he's he's now a little busy. No, I I, I ask Elsa. The ritual is to summon and is summon and bind each creature here, and dismiss them within three hours. And if he's killed. Then he is dead. I generally can bring him back, but... It all depends on what really comes through. He has not lost yet, though. The purpose is not to destroy them, but... Survive. I see. Hmm. Uh -huh. It's an interesting training if you would like to do it yourself. I can do lesser ones for you. That current more pressing things are at hand. Very well. And leads you back into the mansion. And yeah. You guys are now back in. You're now free to move about the mansion. If you guys are going to drink it, Elsa will be there. Yeah, yeah I'll drink the goo. Yeah. I'm Who's going to drink it? Can't hear you. Can't hear you. I forgot I had muted the cough. Uh, I will drink it as soon as people have prepared me to do so. Creature gets what? Okay. Oh wow, okay. that's a lot of nice stuff. Oh, I guess we don't need bless then. Yeah. <laughs> Can we stack another bless on top of that? <laughs> Probably not. Super blessed. Hashtag super blessed. No. <laughs> I'd like to be casting protection from good and evil and good. Like from evil. Uh, from on each person that does it. So, unless it just breaks it, in which case. Sorry. Yeah, so when you do protection from evil and good, as soon as you move closer to the vial, it's like the vial just begins boiling inside. Maybe okay. not whatever that is. Is that worried as much? Alright. Uh, can I give everyone, or can I give Evan and uh, Leo Bardic Inspiration. Well, you may do so. Okay. Uh, yeah. All right. I will drink the goo. You drink the goo. The goo is uh -huh. drunk. Oh, I should also probably strip off this armor and shirt and not let me not get my clothes stained. Sit here in my boxers and do this shit. <laughs> I mean, it, it's a good idea. Honestly. Blue is definitely down for this idea. Oh yeah. Uh huh. Um. So, 
one second. I need to. One second. One second. I'll, I'll just hang out and give an aura, I guess. One second. It says three four. <laughs> one it worked on me, so I don't know. Look, I don't know. Trying to help Jamie. God. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just see what Crystal's really I got at. All right, so. Leo! Yes. You wake up in a small shack. Okay. You stretch, yawn, get up, move outside, and uh, you see spirit. She's not doing a whole lot. She seems to be just reading a book. You uh, also see... Oh, I, gods, I, I can't remember every single fucking name in it, all of existence. Hold on. Erica, that's her name. Uh, she is moving a large slab of metal. You walk over to her, ask her what she's up to, and said, Rose said to move metal. So, I'm moving metal. No, don't worry about it. It's your day off. Go have some, have a sleep. And, uh, I need you to roll a wisdom save. Alright. Do I get the thing from Saris? You do. Not like you needed it. Hmm. You say, no, please. Let me help you. And... You, she shakes herself. Nope, this was my task. I've got it. No problem. And you, you see her drag it away and disappear behind the shack. You look around and see the forge, or rather the forge house, the smithy. A few hundred feet away. Walk over to it. And uh, as you do, you can hear the sound of metal pounding on metal. Methodical, rhythmic, and, well, I mean, you, knows that, you know that this is Rose. And uh, you walk in, and he looks over at you and says... I thought I told you this was your day off. What do you say in response? I think you probably just shrug and say, not like I have anything else to do. All right, roll a wisdom save. Okay. <laughs> and uh, you grab a you grab a hammer and uh, pull up next to him and he sighs and then throws at you a, the blade of a, of a great axe and says I need this redone. Of course. And uh you go you go to, into pounding and rose watches you as he's hammering and you're doing your best roll of blacksmithing tools uh just normal yeah we've got so many smith tools right now 
yeah, you're doing your best, but you're not sure what he wanted really to do with it. I mean, to you, it's a work of art. Just like anything he makes. But mm -hmm. he asked you to reforge it, so you go about doing your best to reforge it. And uh, he stops hammering at some point, and that's odd because he never stops. Even when even so the even through the past three years that you've known him, two years that you've known him, one year that you've known him, he has never stopped in the middle of a for, uh, forging. And you look up at him. Why haven't you left yet? What do you mean? I would have assumed that you would have stopped listening to others and made your own path. Why have you... Why have you stayed? I don't know where to go. He nods. Not many do. And goes back to pounding. But those words really stick with you. You try to go back to hammering and you just you're just distracted. And I need you to ro roll a wisdom save. I I I I give up. I don't I don't fucking no. I don't plus ten. I don't I don't I don't fucking I don't know. I don't I don't I don't even bother. Why do I even bother <laughs> doing this shit? All right, whatever. Fuck. <laughs> um. <laughs> so. You get, you put down the hammer, and you finally met, muster up the courage to ask Rose, why didn't you send me away? And Rose looks over and, and then just shrugs. You don't have any magic, kid. You ask him, what does that even mean? He shrugs and says, you don't have any magic. It's gone from you. It's broken. The weave just doesn't touch you. It's been interesting to me. Seeing someone who just works with effort. That's why I kept you around. You never cheated once. You never... Sh shirked any duties. You just worked. But do you want to know your problem? You did anything I asked. Without question. Not a moment's thought to it just like you did with your father, just like you did with your mother. You would just do anything anyone told you to. Do you understand? Do you? Do you, do you say anything? I think he just kind of looks and says, perhaps no one has asked me to do something not worth doing. You're going to have to pick your own path today. 
when you do. I'll be sure to forge your sword for it. I'll just nod. For now. Take it. And he holds out what you now know, recognize as your massive greatsword. Leo will take it. And as you do, you come out of it, Leo. And, uh... You turn over and cough up a bit of this the black ichor, but it's not nearly as much as uh, Saris's was. And, uh... I want everybody to roll an arcana except for well leo yeah yeah <laughs> hey guys i'm flying <laughs> so are you though blues up in a chandelier Blues up Prim. Um you So There's always a natural sense to people. No matter where you've been, it's always like this sense of magic around somebody that they have some kind of connection to a force greater than themselves whether it be like a god or some kind of arcane power or some natural magic around them um but it it's it's always faint for leo it's just not fair Now, Alex. Rip. Oof. Alex. Yeah. Um, so here's what happened. You gain the following ability. You're gonna you're gonna need to take some notes. Okay, just a second. I... You are now immune to magic. Immune to magic? Yes. Okay. No matter what anyone does, magical effects cannot touch you anymore. This extends to healing magic as well. I was just thinking that. I will say that healing potions still work because not every healing potion is magical. Some of it can be done with alchemy. But magic itself is just gone for you. This okay. also means, though, that nothing anyone ever does can ever affect you. Man, my really cool saving throw ability? Trash. Doesn't matter. <laughs> well, in the form of wisdom and charisma stuff, usually, yes. Still need deck saves. Mm -hmm. Still need strength saves. And you definitely, definitely need con saves. <gasps> Who's next? You don't feel too good, but I mean, it's not nearly as bad as you would have thought looking at Saris. You okay, Leo? Yeah, I'm fine. 
there. So it's kind of surprised, like, that's it. Did everything help? I think so. I'm sorry if you hear my brother screaming. What the fuck is he yelling about? I don't know. sound like a fucking pigeon. Oh, it's 11.15. It's 11.15 for me, which I know that means it's 12.15 for some people. Or 1.15 for some people. Or 2. I don't know. But what's everybody looking like for time? I'm good. I'm okay. How about the other two? I'm fine. I can do a little longer. Alright, who's next? I, I mean, I can't go much longer, but I can finish up the, the next two. Who, who's who's next? I look towards uh, blue. Blue shrug and she'll go take it. Oh, okay. Sarah, will you catch me? She downs it right next to Saris and falls back. Oh, Alright. Okay. Alicia, I need you to go down to memory time with me. Oh, okay. Private types. Private we don't even types. get to the nope. nope. Bye. That's honestly kind of why I left during Leo's, because I don't want to know. Uh, I was really mm -hmm. curious about what happened to you, but... Yeah, good luck in that, Brim. Good luck. <laughs> if you, Noah, really want to know, I can tell you. I mean, I'm curious. And I, I care I about your know. character. Okay, Jake, do you care? Uh, not really. <laughs> okay. Thank that, <laughs> Jake's just... I mean, got, I mean, I don't know what Chris has planned, so... I I'm mean, just I always do... curious. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm fine. I'm fine with people knowing. It's not going to change how Evan maybe reacts enough. And we'll see. Okay. Um. So Frims was horrible. Uh, she... Sounds like you failed. <laughs> no, I technically did. I think it got really close, didn't it? Nope, I failed. I technically oh. failed, and then I woke up the next morning at 3 or 5 a.m. and was like, Hey, Chris, I was drinking tea. Does any of my tea affect it? <laughs> and it just did. If I had not had Bless, I would have failed. Because I rolled a 14, and the DC is 15. So you would have literally just fucking died. Uh, probably. He had encounters. Nice. He had encounters prepped, apparently. Oh, good. Um, so we would have had to fight. He probably would have fight me, yeah. Um, Man, I could have passed that all on my own. Yeah. I appreciate yeah. the help, and I'm glad I had it, but I think technically, based on what I rolled... Yeah. I mean, the 13. I think I got pretty close to failing, actually. Well, the third I one, I um, I still have my D6, which is a plus 5 for that one, so I... Oh, that's true. That's by true, my true. stuff, I have an 18 as my low. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, so... Anyway, the power of friendship. <laughs> so, uh, Prim woke up in a mansion. And there was a knock at a giant set of double doors in her lavish bedroom. And when she opened the door, um, Gail was outside and he kneeled before her. And said some shit, I can't oh, remember exactly, no. and then he oh. called her mistress, um, oh, oh. he said, uh, the, something, 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 something about the, they are ready outside for you, blah, 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 um, oh, man. I rolled, uh. and I passed, and I recalled from him. Asking what the fuck was up with him, because when I looked into his eyes, it was dark and bleak, and basically emotionless. Like he was some, like he had been charmed. Kind of, yeah. Um, and then he said something about, oh, just kidding. Um. So. 
blue, after drinking it, you know, t tipped back uh, her... She goes silent for a few moments, just like everybody else. Um, her eyes slowly close. And then they reopen. And uh, just they, all but all but the one. Like the middle eye didn't open? Yeah. yeah. Yes. And uh, she doesn't cough up anything or spit up anything, but she doesn't look... And she doesn't look ill or anything like that. She just kind of slowly comes to. Blue. And, uh... Blue, you can do your thing. So for Blue's benefit, um, Saris was looking at her like the most worried she's ever been. So you get that. Uh, were you holding her? Yes. <laughs> so. Uh, Blue immediately jumps out of your grasp. Oh. Like, pushes you away. <laughs> okay. Uh, Blue... Oh, okay. Ew, okay. Um, yeah. Hi. Why didn't you cough it up? Mm. Cough what up? Maybe I just didn't have any. Are Wait. you okay? Yeah, I'm perfectly fine. I'm blue. Dabu dee, dabu die. I feel like I feel like there's some insight there. Yeah, she yeah. is acting a bit fucking weird. Go ahead, go ahead. First you off, guys may you? roll insight if you like. Uh. Okay, so Saris, what are you looking for? Oh, okay, I'll I'll go down the list. Evan, what are you looking for? Um, just knowing Blue, you know, Blue who doesn't really uh have sense of boundaries jumping out of someone's grasp instead of just like falling into it how why and why what why did she do that yeah like just seeing how she's reacting to like any what like to the touch basically all right Is she just blue. shying away from any and all contact blue blue would you say that was disgust or you were just trying to like quickly escape because it was like you you were you were shocked about the moment what what were you gonna what would you say uh no she just oh kinda... wait 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 before 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 you say anything before you say anything gm roll whichever check you would make against their insight Oh. <laughs> she roll a one. <laughs> no, she didn't. You roll a two. No, she didn't. Um. So, continue what you were saying, but assuming um, you failed. Yes. Uh. So. I would say it was less discussed. Um, she's kind of inching towards the door. So it was more that she just... Take that as you will. It wasn't discussed. She jumped out quick and is now kind of moving towards the door to the kitchen. Oh, I see. And she's like, I'm going to get something to drink. She's looking for windows. Got it. Leo. <laughs> what were you looking for? anything to suggest that this is not our blue. Hmm. Blue, how do you see your friends right now? I, I got a quick question. Did Leo put his clothes back on? Yes, he's oh, put damn, some clothes back on. I forgot back. to say that Blue was going to strip for hers. Damn it. <laughs> she didn't. She didn't strip. Damn she, it! She was she too caught up in the moment. Now, did she? she did she though? She didn't throw um, up though. So it might affect like, things. Do you want me to describe how she actually feels, or what it looks like when she's what it at looks guys? like when she sees? What do you look like when you look at them? Uh She's got, like, this kind of fake smile, 
like the kind you have when someone's showing you something that you're proud of and you think is cool and they obviously think sucks, but they're trying to be nice about it. So is this a standard look for Blue at us? No. No. Okay. She so looks Leah at you guys thinks like this you're is not awesome. our Blue. <laughs> Ferris, what are you looking for when you're looking at Blue? So, like, that's not a reaction she expected at all. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, reaction I expected something appropriate. Um, because that's always what it has been. Like, this is the person that she knows, unless... Does she, she can she tell it's a similar reaction to the window situation? Blue. She's not blushing. Okay. Um Primrose. Hmm. How to word this. <clears throat> can I physically tell why or get an insight as to why she did not throw up? Hmm. Alright. Roll me an arcana at advantage. Okay. Uh, great. Me. Okay, so rip. the only assumption that you can make is that, based on the t context clues with your talk with Elsana, mm -hmm. and um, based on like what you know, what that everybody has been telling you that you know you could die, you could die, mm -hmm. you could die, or and that blue failed. That's the only thing you can think of. Okay. Um, is Elsana in the room? Would Elsana be in the room? Yes. While you guys were taking this, yes. Looking over to her, what's her reaction? Let me go see. She could fail. Oh, she's she's like, oh, this is blue, all right. This is the same person I met yesterday. I mean, look at him. Yeah. Exactly the same. <laughs> she Pretty is much. very much blue. That's all. That's all. Elsana. Elsana's looking at her. So she's concerned about the fact that blue didn't puke up anything, but she doesn't know what it means. So, now you may all react how you're going to react. Uh, yeah, so, you know, I actually think it was starting to come up, and it didn't. My throat sucks. I'm gonna get some water. I'll be right back. Um, Blue? Yeah? Did you fail? <laughs> Wow. Uh, I'm being I serious. Did failed? you fail? She like steps I forward and prim, grabs your wrist. Prim, or sorry, not prim. Blue looks like seriously offended and like tries to get out of your grasp. And she's like, I, I... want both of you roll athletic. Prim, you gotta roll an athletics. That uh, grab a voice. Uh, the other one has to roll athletics and acrobatics. There you go. Yeah, she immediately gets out of your grasp, Prim. I do Leo. not fail. Leo, grab her, what? please. Okay. Wait. I try to grab her. Ha ha! <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, never mind. <laughs> and she vanishes. Uh, Lucy turns into an imp. Lou, please stop. No, 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 sorry. 
Can you explain the room to me real quick? Uh, it is a two-door kitchen. One leads out to the, to, like, the, 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 like, what is the main hall of the, oh, of the mansion? Room. Fuck. The foyer? 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 Yeah, that one. And the other one leads out towards, like, more rooms. You know which one is which. She's going to kick down the door, going to the place with more rooms. Like, you see the door swing wide open that way. Um. Alright, everybody everybody sees the door swing open. Elsana. And Elsana will, like, look around. She's going to attempt to cast a spell. Like, wait, let me make sure she has it first. Prim looks severely she, worried. She she does have the spell. <laughs> you sound surprised. I am a genius. Sure, Chris. Sure. I mean, okay. Cause she cast that. Yeah, I was looking for my familiars because I know one of them. Who the fuck prepares the invisibility? I literally artificers do. Uh, which one of my fucking things is being Especially in the Feywild. Mm -hmm. after, after I said that, like, oh yeah, that does make sense. Oh, right. Last <laughs> dragon. Just kidding. Oh, she's standing next to the door. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She's next to the door! Fuck. And I'm, like, she's... almost out the door, so... <laughs> she's gonna run, and... Ta-da! <laughs> you see these big red you see these big blue with star curtains appear as she runs right through it. Alright, your invisibility you drops your but she name. jumps but but your I but, don't think it is. It's not you, concentration. You casted a spell though. Your invisibility breaks on spell cast. Yeah. Actually oh, right, yes. does, Sorry. but yeah. Great invis greater invisibility is the one you're thinking of. Mm -hmm. That's right, yeah. Um, so you jump through, and where'd you go? Uh, how close to the main exit can I get? You can get as close as you possibly can. Cause it's right yep. Here. Close as I possibly can, and I'm gonna get out. I don't think anyone has anything to stop her with. Nope. Nope. Like, I do. Spells. It's the power of no magic at all. I keep getting, I keep getting my fucking characters mixed up. I'm like, oh no, I have counter spell. Nope, that's Ash. Ah, shit. Um, how close can I get to her before she's like gone? Okay. Okay. I need to be within thirty feet. Okay, you were within thirty feet the whole time. Okay. Uh, I could have fucking cast curse tones on her because then she wouldn't be able to do any spell casting. Can I, I command her to stay. Okay. Okay. Unfortunately for you, that doesn't affect teleports. I know. That's what I want to do right after, but if, if that's uh, that, the question was if I could be within thirty feet of her when she's at that door, but if that's not possible, I mean I she's know. she's always she she was she was within thirty feet of you the whole time. So after the teleport, so if she teleports again, she can still. Yeah, she if she te okay. no 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 after the teleport she is out of the thirty feet. But okay, like, that's while what you I was were asking. In the, it, while you were in the room. She, okay. she, she was within, hold on, let me think. No, you would, it, 30 feet, 30 feet's not far enough. Um, okay, while within, while within the, with, while within the room, she was within 30 feet of you. Okay. It wouldn't work anyway. All right. Mm -hmm. So you go out the door, I assume, Blue? Yep. All right. And Good that's where we're going to end, end session. Aw, oh, damn it. Well, Blue's dead. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Damn it. 
Oh, um, what about 60 feet? Sorry. <laughs> 60 right. feet. What, do you, what, what do you got? What do you got? Command. Command. That doesn't work. Okay. No, not long because, enough? Because... No, no, no. It's because you have to be able to see the target, right? Yeah. And But once she cast action, it, she was visible. She, right? she, Once she casted it, she was gone. Yeah. You okay, so we could... Like, turn, turn order. Turn order. It was her turn, and you she would need used to be her turn command. to leave. You would okay. need to have readied command. Which is why I'm not interrupting and being like, hey, can I try this and this? Because I'm like, she's gone. Well, There's well, nothing I'm, I can I'm do. I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't know that. Right. I, I appreciate you trying. Alright. So. I'm yeah, sorry. It's your turn now. <laughs> <laughs> No, it's not, because we're at, we're done for the night, apparently. <laughs> we can start with you, Evan, or you can RP it out via text, or you can we can talk later. But I know it's at twelve thirty for you. Yeah, that's why that's why I stopped. Stupid work. Uh, we'll figure it out. All right. Should maybe try to catch blue before Evan just downs it but you do you man <laughs> yeah no I mean at, at this point Evan's gonna be like well if she doesn't want to support her friends then I guess that's what she wants and he'll go over to hold his file in his hand no, she's, she wants to support her friends she just doesn't see any of us as friends anymore well, I mean, you guys don't know. We'll figure it out. It's fine. Yeah. You guys have some time, though. Well, we've seen something like, oh, well, we've seen how solid she is. Great. <laughs> and that's it. So, uh, Alicia, I'm going to need a moment of your time. Okay. Again. And then, and but everybody else, uh, you guys can do... Um, campfire from here. However you want to. I'm I'm sure Saris is just going to be like, I'm running out the door. Mm. I mean, so it's fine. But, but, yeah. Uh, quick question. Well, actually, two quick questions. One, does this mean I don't get Saris's aura anymore? Or is that not magic? Oh, that is not magic. What about my teeth? Also, not magic. Cool. Because you're you're just making tea. Yeah. Like the outcome is tea. The magic is basically making tea. Okay. Cool. The aura is. The aura is also, um, like An it's outcome. it's not it's not magic in the sense of the arcane variety more of a um more of a divine nature well uh, i'll think about it because i guess i guess if you're not affected by other things auras mm -hmm. too then Saracen. you wouldn't be affected by saris's so i'll think about it i'll have to think yeah. on that one like would he be affected by like well here here's the thing fireball uh well my question is uh, is he affected by Blue's uh, Bardic Inspiration still? Oh, well, that's a different thing. I don't know. It's kind of like a similar sort of I will have to think on presence it. kind of thing. I will have to think on it. Okay. I'm and then saying. question two was, what are we doing on Wednesday? Yeah. What are we doing? Yeah. What I are we doing on Wednesday? To alternate. I don't know. Did, you wanted to alternate, right? Uh, if that's okay with you guys. Uh, it's fine by me. I just need to know what I'm doing. 
<laughs> um, I make my you need to make me. You need to make me a villain. I will make you a villain. A villain in a crime. It's Leo with a mustache. <laughs> and don't have it be throw mushrooms at people. Yeah, somebody already took that. <laughs> Damn it! My one villain requirement: mushrooms. <laughs> Sorry, that crime is already that crime slot has already been taken. Damn. Listen, no one can be more villainous than I. Which you know you've missed the golden opportunity to be the drug dealer. No. How dare you refer to the collective as just mere drugs? All right, Alita, should let me borrow you for a second. All right. <laughs> yes. Well, Chris, I'll, I'll see you guys you. later. I'll message you at some point, Chris. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Bye. Night, guys. Night.